Now, I've been writing software professionally for around 15 years now. And this question here still sneaks into my head sometimes. Am I getting better or just older? Looking back, I've learned that real growth in this industry here isn't about mastering frameworks or chasing trends. It's about patience, curiosity and keeping your spark alive when deadlines, bugs and burnout pile up. So here's what I've learned so far. Number one, you are better than you think you are. Now many developers struggle with confidence. We all know imposter syndrome, right? But if you love to code, keep learning and genuinely care about improving, you already belong here. That passion gives you an edge. When you land your first job, you might even work faster than other people with more experience. And when you suggest new ideas, someone will eventually say, we've always done it that way. Now that hurts, but don't let it crush your curiosity. Stay hungry, stay open, and if you feel stuck in a culture that doesn't value growth, then move on. Number two, you are not as good as you think you are. Now, college teaches theories that rarely survive real-world projects. UML diagrams, beautiful on paper, but rarely used. Test-driven development, this is a great idea, but sometimes there's just no time for it. Now, business goals often win over best practices. This is frustrating, but reality. So your job is to find the balance and protect your craft where you can. So still be patient before judging your company too harshly. There's often more behind the curtain than you see at first. Number three, learn through side projects. Now side projects are how many of us grow. They let you play with tech your job doesn't use. Try crazy ideas and build something that's 100% yours. I once taught myself Web API 2 this way because my company was stuck in the past. I know that was a long time ago, but that project helped me land a new job where they actually needed those skills. But it's not just about career growth, it's also about joy. Building something from nothing feels incredible. Number four, soft skills matter. There's still this old joke about developers hiding in dark rooms and avoiding people. Forget that, right? You can be introverted and still be great at connecting with others. Say hi to teammates, ask how they're doing and smile more. Soft skills aren't about being loud. They do more for your career than another framework ever will. Number five, communication is everything. Now, most problems in software come from poor communication. Requirements get lost, tasks get mixed up, someone hides a mistake. Talk to your team, share what you're working on, ask questions. It is not about being talkative. It's about staying aligned. Clear communication saves projects, relationships, and sleep. <laughs> Number six, you're not a quitter if you quit. If you are unhappy at your job, it's okay to leave. Loyalty is great, but not when it costs your health. There's no price for burning out. You don't owe your company your happiness, right? There are plenty of places where you'll feel valued and supported. Find one, you deserve it. Number seven, learning never stops. Now, technology moves fast, we know that. You'll always be learning something new, but you don't have to chase every shiny thing, right? Just stay curious, read, watch, and experiment when something catches your interest. The worst thing you can do is stop learning. Growth keeps the work exciting. Number eight, don't take it too seriously. At the end of the day, it is just code. We build things that break, then fix them again. Enjoy that process. Find joy in solving small problems. Celebrate little wins and when things go wrong, breathe. Always remember that famous quote, you can code, they cannot. That is pretty damn cool. Number nine, it's a marathon, not a sprint. Early in your career, you want to prove yourself. You work late, chase perfection and never rest. Eventually, you learn that longevity matters more than speed. Protect your health, all right? Take time off. Your mind writes better code when it is rested. Number 10, tools change, principles don't. Now, frameworks rise and fall, languages come and go. But clean code, solid design and clear communication, this never goes out of style. Focus on those, they will outlast any trend. Number 11, mentorship multiplies your impact. There is a limit to what you can do by yourself alone. 
but when you help someone else grow, your impact doubles. Seeing a junior developer become confident because of your guidance feels better than any promotion does. If you've learned something, pass it on. That's how this industry gets better. Number 12, leadership isn't a title. You don't need to manage people to lead. You lead when you take ownership, when you help a teammate, when you stand up for good code or good people. So leadership is about responsibility and not that rank. And the best leaders, honestly, are often the quiet ones who deeply care. Number 13, the best developers understand the business. Code is just a tool. The real value is in what that code does for people. When you understand the why behind what you're building, your decisions get better. You stop just writing code and start creating solutions that matter. Number 14, your network is your safety net. Skills matter, but people matter more. Stay in touch with coworkers, help others when you can, and a strong network can change your life when you least expect it. Your next opportunity might come from someone you helped years ago. And number 15, teaching is the ultimate learning. The best way to master something is to teach it. Ask me. Explain it to a friend to record a video or write about it. Teaching forces you to simplify, clarify and truly understand. So every time you share knowledge, you grow too. And I got one bonus for you. Gratitude beats comparison. It's easy to look around and feel behind. Someone's always earning more, shipping faster or getting promoted. But after 15 years, I've learned that success isn't about being the best. Really, it's about being happy, doing what you love, solving problems, building things out of nothing, helping others grow. This is real success. So 15 years in, I still get that same spark when a piece of code finally works, that moment when everything clicks. That's how I know I'm still exactly where I am meant to be. And honestly, it doesn't matter if it's web development or game development, it's still just awesome, even or maybe in particular in the age of AI. So now if you've been coding for a while, what's the biggest lesson you've got for us? Thank you very much for watching. I hope I see you next time. Take care.